Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your Slack account and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you integrate your Google sheets to your Slack account? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to integrate your Google sheets into Slack anyway? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, you know, if you can automate certain tasks, it cuts down on the movement and it allows you to be a lot more efficient. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's actually handled in your Slack account, not in Google Sheets. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well. But I've already logged into my Slack account and this is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to integrate Google Sheets to your Slack, first what you're going to do is look down here on the bottom left. There's a button here called apps. You're going to open it up and at the bottom, you're going to see this button, add apps. Okay, so once you do that, in order to link your Google Sheets, what you're going to do is click here in the search bar and type in Google Sheets. All right, once you do that, you want to look for the green logo right here and click on add. Okay, so once you do that, Slack is going to give you a little information on the benefits of connecting your Google Sheets to Slack. So first, what you want to do is go ahead and click on this green add to Slack button. Okay, next Slack lets you know the permissions that you're going to be accessing with your Google Sheets. If you're okay with that, click on allow. Okay, a quick second later, you're going to see this confirmation that Google Sheets for Workflow Builder, it's installed. So we can jump back on over to our Slack account. Okay, so here we are on Slack. And as you can see, Google Sheets workflow steps are added here. Okay, so as you can see, when creating a workflow, you're going to be able to have these steps intertwined with your Google Sheets. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to connect your Google Sheets to your Slack account, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.